All right. Well, happy Friday, guys. Unfortunately, I'm not here uh, on a celebratory note. Um, the reason why I'm putting this quick video together and having a quick chat with you is it is more than overdue to expose another uh, of the scuttling, skulking cockroaches that has been scheming, lying, plotting behind the scenes uh, in an effort to smear me specifically. All of you know Adara on YouTube, and you also know her as such on Facebook. So this is something that I have been well aware of for, oh, at least I think a year now that she has been doing. Um, and I'd be very, for curiosity sakes, Anybody that does feel comfortable and wants to drop in the comments below that they were somebody that received uh, this type of message um, from Zernita on Facebook. Um, basically, the message, some something along the lines of uh, this one was sent uh, to somebody that forwarded, uh, forwarded it on to me uh, from earlier this week. Hey there. Notice, by the way, the icon avatar and the one of Zernita's from Facebook. It's the same one because it's her. Hey there, I was wanting to catch up a bit when possible. Did Tasha get in touch with you and explain JC's involvement with BAM? I did message you about that in August last year on the 18th after I'd sent a video message about it, but thought you might have forgotten what I said or restricted messages from me because at that time, I know you didn't want to think anything was awry about or with JC. Zernita, Adara, whoever the fuck you are, you have now been fully fucking exposed for the piece of fucking shit you are as well. Working behind the scenes with the likes of D Hand, Chafer, Val, Scissor Hands, running around Facebook trying to get people to turn on me. I don't even know what this video message is you sent out, but I can only imagine. Not that it's any of anybody's fucking business, but there, uh, there's no involvement of me with BAM. I have no fucking clue, obviously, what you're trying to allude to, but it's obviously with the intention of being something completely and utterly nefarious. I've had Zernita, Adara, many people contact me about these kind of messages that you've been sending out. And you know what? I've sat back and I've let you continue and continue. Well, because all of your little fucking buddies, handful of buddies are exposing themselves for the horrible, horrible creatures they are. It's time to blow you out of the fucking water once and for all. So everybody, how about this? If Martin Dehan, Helen Chafer, Val Scissorhands, Cartoon Tasha, Adara slash Zernita and company all have the truth on their side and have absolutely nothing to hide, why are they going to such great lengths in all of this scheming, lying, plotting, behind the scenes, in front of the scenes, trying everything they can to make me look like a horrible villain in all this. Think about that. And again, I do want to direct attention to more double standard duplicity. Somehow I've become the rotten bad apple because I very clearly have stated for the mean time, mean time, I will not be making any armchair detective videos because I want absolutely zero association with the beyond totally unacceptable, beyond totally inappropriate debauchery from super fucking idiot and so forth that's been going on. However, truth justice throwing in the towel entirely is seen by these same people as perfectly understandable and acceptable. You all have exposed yourself all on your own for the disingenuous, horrible people that have no moral compass, 
no fucking real genuine character to them either. You're all a bunch of fucking social rejects and you've all exposed yourselves.